we the people. It's the, it's the unseen people. It's not the most popular people. It's not the wealthiest people. We the people was never meant to be about the people with the most influence or those that lived in the biggest cities or those that lived in the biggest houses or had the greatest pieces of land or property. We the people was always about the person that was unseen. And this was a, a reminder, I think, to us that that Constitution was about the government serving we the people and not we the people serving the government. It's about coming back to who we are, remembering we the people, getting our country back financially, getting a wisdom back in the marketplace, getting wisdom back in our government. You know, the Bible says in the book of Daniel that Daniel and his three friends, the governor, the king, found that they had 10 times the wisdom of other leaders. And I believe this, in the next decades to come, God's going to be raising up statesmen and women that have godly wisdom to solve some of our biggest crises that we have. Not only in the international wars and battles that we're facing, but also domestically. And I really believe this, when we're strong domestically, we'll lead well internationally. I believe in God. I believe in America. I believe in Iowa. I believe in you. I'm asking you to believe in me. I'm asking you to think through this moment we're in. Would you pray? Would you ask God, is, is now the time for a different leadership in the White House?